Hello, this is McD the Beast, and this is McD Sports 4 coming to you today with my University of Missouri Tigers football predictions. Um, Missouri last year had a very good offense. I think they kind of got lucky last year because they faced Tennessee and Florida when everybody knew that they stinked. Um, but I, this year is going to be different, I think. I think Missouri is going to earn um, their wins and not just get by with their wins. But anyways, they're gonna ha what I mean basically is that they're going to have to earn their wins, not... Oh, we're facing Tennessee at home, but we're going to bl blow them out by 30. I don't think that's going to be happening this year. But anyways, um, let's dive into these numbers where my cursor is. Uh, the FBI has them going 7-5. and five. Gives them a 0% chance of going undefeated, a 1% chance of winning the SEC. And the 37th hardest schedule out of 130 teams. So looking at the schedule, um, you do have to go on the road against Purdue, um, South Carolina, Alabama, Florida, and Tennessee. Uh, you get Georgia at home, and you get Memphis at home. So a lot of your more tougher games this year are on the road if you're in Missouri or Mizzou, whoever the fan base wants me to call them. But... I think Missouri could have a pretty decent year. I think the offense is going to be awesome this year. I I think they'll be a top five offense in college football. Um, Jeff um, Locke, uh, he's probably going to be an NFL quarterback. So it's going to be really fun watching this Missouri offense. But I don't know if the defense is that good. So and I don't think they're going to be that good again this year. So that's my view about Missouri. Um, so let's actually say my best case and worst case scenario real quick. Um, best case scenario for Missouri, in my opinion, is nine and three, and they sneak their way into a New Year Six bowl. Uh, and they're gonna have to like probably go on the road at Bama and beat Georgia. Um, if they win those two and go, let's say nine and three, I definitely think they're in a New Year Six bowl. Or I think the worst case scenario is four and eight. So I think let's see what I have them going. Um, Game by game predictions. And we're going to start off with our first game here is against um, UT Martin. Um, not a um, group of five or power five opponent. I think Missouri wins big here. I think it hits 60 plus on um, UT Martin. As I have them being UT Martin 66 to 31. Next game is Wyoming. Um, no Josh Allen, no problem for the Missouri defense, but I do think um, Wyoming will put up points against um, Missouri only because I think Missouri's defense will be bad. And I have, but I do have Missouri winning this game. I have them winning the game 53-28. So second win of the year for um, Missouri. Next game at Purdue. Um, Purdue's gonna be similar to Missouri, a pretty damn good offense, but not a good defense. This is going to have a chance to probably be one of the most, um, the, the highest scoring game of the year, in my opinion. Um, I believe this game might be at, no, it's actually not at neutral site. It's in West Lafayette. But I think um, what's going to happen is that um, Purdue's going to win this game at home. I know Purdue went into Missouri being last year, but I think Purdue's going to sweep the series, and they're going to be um, Missouri at home in a shootout. I'm going to say they win this game. Let's go fifty. Let's go um fifty-nine fifty-two. Um, to do in this one. So first loss of the year for Missouri. Next game is Georgia at home. Um, I already did Georgia football predictions once again. I I did. I've already done five predictions for um five teams on the schedule. I've already done predictions for, and that is Georgia, South Carolina, Alabama, Memphis, and Florida. So I'll put the links up for those videos. Um, I'll probably have like four of them at the end. You can just click on, and then the last one um, will be up in the left hand corner. But I think um, personally, I think um, Georgia um, will um, go into Missouri and beat them. I feel like Missouri's going to stay in this game to the end. It's going to come down to um, probably if whoever has the ball last but I'm going to sit there and say the Bulldog, the Georgia Bulldog defense does give up points to Missouri but 
Missouri still loses this game, 45-42. So, Missouri then gets a bye going into um, the bye week at 2-2. Two and two. Out of the college football playoff conversation at this point, in my opinion, if you're Missouri. Next game is at South Carolina. Just did South Carolina football predictions earlier this week. Earlier today, actually. Um, you go check those out. But, um, what I'm going to do is actually pick, um, what I said in that game was that I went back and forth with this one. Um, I just feel like at the end of the day, though, South Carolina at home is just going to give South Carolina the edge. And I have Missouri also losing this game, 45-43. So, definitely out of um, college football contention. I said that in, after the loss of Georgia, they're officially out, in my opinion. Because, as you learned from last year, Alabama got in. Not, I, Alabama, I, I believe, got in with um, two losses. Actually, no, Alabama got in without a conference championship. And um, someone got in with two losses so, before. So, I, I don't know. I, I, I might be just um, saying random stuff. But anyways, next game is... At Alabama, um, I think Nick Saban's defense uh, is going to struggle in this game because Jeff Locke will throw the ball. But I still have Alabama winning this game. I mean, I'm, I have them winning the game 55-49. I think Alabama's offense is actually going to be the reason why they win this game. And I'm also going to say Alabama's offense is going to be pretty good this year too. So that puts uh, Missouri at 2-4. and four, So... Just a, just a, um, they're gonna have to really, really play hard and win out. They want to make even a bowl game at this point. Next game at is home in against Memphis. Um, went back and forth in this game. Already did Memphis football predictions, but I went with Missouri at home in this one, and I actually have it Missouri scoring 55 points and Memphis 49 points. So, flip the score from Missouri um against Memphis. So. That's so uh, now I have uh, Missouri at three and four. So a win against Memphis. I think they also beat Kentucky at home. Um, I think they beat Kentucky at home. I have them winning this game, forty-eight to thirty-nine. Next game is at Florida. I, I think a lot of points are going to be scored in this game. I think this has a chance, just like the Purdue game, to be the highest scoring game of the year. Uh, in college football, but I had to go for that at home. I have Missouri losing by a touchdown, 56-49. I already did Florida football predictions. You can check that out at the um. You can just go on my channel and check that one out. Next game is Vanderbilt. Um, at home at this point, Missouri is um. They're going to be four and five. They're going to have to be desperate for a win. I think to get the win here against Vanderbilt. I think Vanderbilt stays in this game, though. I would say that as I have Missouri, I think Missouri pits up 50 plus on them. As I have Missouri paying up 55, but I think Vanderbilt pits up a nice 42 points on them. So 55, 42, Missouri in that game. At this point, Missouri's five and five. They're going on the road against Tennessee. I've seen people pick the upset for this one. I, I I just couldn't. To me, like Tennessee is like a poor man's version of Missouri. If you want the honest truth, um, Tennessee's offense I think will be decent this year. I think their defense is gonna be god awful, and I'm gonna say Missouri picks up 50 plus on them again, as I have Missouri paying uh, up um 54 points. I think Tennessee will score some in this game. Um, so I have a 54 41 Missouri, and that puts Missouri in a bowl game at six and five. And to wrap things up, at home on Friday, on a Friday, um, Black Friday after uh, Thanksgiving, uh, against Arkansas, I think they beat Arkansas. Um, Arkansas is kind of gonna be in rebuilding uh, mode, but I think Missouri, Missouri at home will beat Arkansas. I'm gonna say 49 to 38. So that's um. So I have Missouri going seven and five. Adam giving up a lot of points this year, as you can see, the, lo the lowest amount of points Adam giving up is actually at, is their second game against Wyoming, 28 points. So, and at one point I'm going to have them at two and four. So, 
I think Missouri is definitely not in college football New Year Six Bowl or college um, football playoff contention at all. And I agree with the FPI. I have them going seven and five with a uh, with a four four and four record in the um, SEC. I believe. Let's see, loss, loss, loss. Yeah, four and four record in the SEC. So, pretty decent year um, for Missouri. I said Missouri will have to earn their wins this year. So, rather than last year giving, just give, just um, playing teams that are even in contention for New Year's um, six bowls or college football bowls at all, really. So, I mean, Missouri's gonna have to earn um, the wins this year, in my opinion. So that's my opinion about Missouri. Uh, comment down below, um, tell me what you think about uh, my Missouri football predictions, and thanks for watching, and, this is, and please like and subscribe, and this is McBee the Peace, signing off.